The life of a long-distance trucker is a lonely one. They haul their cargo all over the country, hopping from one truck stop to the next. Depending on their route, it could be days, even weeks, before they return home and see their families. So truckers form a new sort of family, made up of others they meet on the road. But this family is not bound by blood. This family is bound by the daily hardships they all share and endure, and sometimes, with a little help, overcome. Put a little more coffee down here, darling. You got any hot sauce? Coming. <clears throat> Hang on. Okay. All right. Who ordered the broken plate special? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's okay, honey. Ship's almost over. Well, I guess I better go home and start cooking. It takes me two entire days to cook everything for Thanksgiving. What about you? Hey, you know, you're doing good. You're kidding, right? No, I'm not. You're doing great. You've only been here three weeks. Great job. Everybody else had quit by now. I can't afford to quit. How long you been doing this? Uh, 11, 12 years. Oh my gosh. Well, I didn't mean to stay this long. Time just kind of got away from me. It's not so bad once you get the hang of it. I mean, for me personally, this works out. It gives me a chance to like talk to people and get to know them, you know, be friendly. You know, these old guys really do like you. How can you tell? They're just tired and hungry. They've been driving all day. They're good men. Real angels. Every one of them. You married? Yeah. What's he do? I wouldn't know. I haven't seen him in six months. Oh, honey. It's okay. We're better off without him. Just broke. Well, how many kids you got? Four. Littlest ones, two. Lordy. It's okay. We're doing okay. On this salary? Mm-hmm. And you, what about you? How you doing? I'm hanging in there. Kids, how they holding up? They're good. You know, they... <laughs> I have $17 in the bank. I use my tip money to pay a babysitter while I'm here. The rest goes to rent. And food. I don't. When they look at me, still hungry, and I can't do anything, I don't have any more. Hey. Shh. Be all right. You're be all right. You're doing good. You're doing really good. You're doing a good job at work. You're doing the best you can. You're a good mama. You don't have one thing to be ashamed of. Okay. I'll be alright. I'm sorry. I don't usually act like this. Hey, you know what? Why don't you just let me finish up and run on home, okay? You sure? Yeah. Everything's fine. Go on. Good. Come on. Thanks. You know, I'll manage. I'll be alright. Sure you will. Thanksgiving, everybody goes home to see their families. I'm kind of glad it's slow so we can go home. Yeah. But there comes a the convoy. Oh, no. No, I promised the kids I'd be home on time. Oh, it's okay. I got it. Go on home. 
No, Wanda, there's way too many for you to handle on your own. Excuse me, I said I was fine. I can handle it. Now go home and be with your children. These are direct orders from your supervisor, okay? Thanks. Did you forget something? There's some things in my car. Wonder what that could be. Is all that from everyone in here? I told you they were all angels once in a while. Oh, thank you. Happy Thanksgiving, Janice. Thank you. Thank all of you. <laughs> 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 